Hello, I'm Mary from the Story Massage Programme and this is a manual who I will be demonstrating on today. I'm going to be demonstrating a really beautiful story written by Pete Wells, um, sensorystoriespodcast.com and the story is Lolly Ladybird's Got Spots. Um, and there is actually um, a podcast um, on um, Pete's website um, you can see here, episode 10, um, and Peter's got lots and lots of lovely information about um, using sensory props to go with this story, and all the words are there too, and illustrations, so do head over to sensorystoriespodcast.com um, for more information about the story, but I'm going to demonstrate it as a, um, as a massage story. So I'll be demonstrating on Emmanuel's back. Um, but you could be massaging wherever is accessible and wherever is appropriate. Um, I'll just take off Emmanuel's wings. They do look rather beautiful, but if I'm going to be massaging on his back, then that's not much good. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do is to ask permission. So Emmanuel, please may I give you a story massage? And Emmanuel's saying that yes, today he would love to have a story massage. So do follow along. Lolly Ladybird's scarlet shell is covered in big black spots. So she's off to see Dr Roach. She's worrying lots and lots. Sitting nervously in the waiting room there are mini beasts, big and small, of every shape and colour. Oh, they don't look well at all. She sits next to a troubled snail who's got no get up and go. He moans, I'm going to see the doctor to see why I'm so slow. Next sat a hungry caterpillar who was nervous about his meeting. He said, I have to see the doctor about my never ending eating. By the plant, a sad stick insect who sobbed, it's just not fair. Everyone ignores me, it's like I'm not even there. And whizzing round the waiting room, Woody Woodlouse cries to all. Each time that I get frightened, I turn into a ball. No one sat next to the yellow wasp, who looked angry and a little sad. She said, if you get close to me, I can't help getting mad. Next, a tired looking cricket, who sobbed, there must be something wrong. Instead of sleeping when it's night time, I make noises all night long. There was a rather worried firefly whose face was filled with fright. Quick, someone tell the doctor, my bottom is a light. Dr Roach called all into her surgery. She said, there's nothing wrong with you. Your features make you who you are. They're all a part of you. So if you're a little different, you're not poorly nor bizarre. It's just the way that you've been made. You're great the way you are. Thank you, Emmanuel. 
Thank you for letting me give you a story massage. Well, I hope that you enjoyed that story massage. Um, it's a programme of ten strokes, and those ten strokes are all used to illustrate the words of the story, as you could see. Um, if you want any more information about our online training course, um, our book, and all our resources, then please do email.